All right, welcome back. Today we're going to do Motu matchup number 11, and we've got our 1984 vintage web store with our Origins version over here on the right. Uh, you can see the same, similar stylings. Uh, there's a little bit of difference in the way the armor uh, sits on his chest. See how it's a little bit lower here. Uh, we've got the same gun. They use the same mode to recreate this gun. Uh, Color-wise, there is some differences. The head sculpts very similar uh, I am missing the actual uh, winch for the back of the vintage uh, but it is almost identical to the one that comes with uh, our new version this one's a little bit bulkier uh, but it works pretty much the same way uh, we are missing the the twist feature in the waist with our origins uh, which is a common thing for all the origins figures and they none of the origins figures had that uh, spring action uh, but yeah, we've got our standard articulation on this guy. This one's actually in pretty good shape. His legs are, are tight. His arms are tight. Uh, he does have some uh, discoloration on his head, which is pretty typical for a figure that's been sitting in a box for decades. Uh, but yeah, I, I do like this new one, though. I like this shade of blue. Of course, it doesn't have that shine that the uh, original had, uh, but this this the deep blue I really dig um, yeah so everything else is it's pretty pretty accurate I do like uh, I like the head sculpt the eyes are a little bit bigger um, yeah so I, I think I think right off the bat I'm gonna say I prefer this new one but to be fair I was never really into web store I don't know I just never really cared for him in the animated series at one point there was a version of him. It wasn't. I don't think they even called him Web Store, but he had four arms, which was really cool. Uh, I know I've seen some uh, uh, some three D printed add ons you can do for the Origins to give him four arms, which is pretty cool. Uh, yes, it, little attachments that come off the back. But yeah, so on our Origins version, just so I can show you how this works, you've got the grappling hook. And I'm going to take it and hook it up somewhere just to show you how this works. Hopefully it pull the string and he ascends to wherever you're, we've got him connected to. So unfortunately it's kind of off, off camera so you can't really see it. But yeah, I just hooked this up up high and pull the string and it pulls him up. It's a pretty neat, uh, pretty neat little feature. I dig it. But I really love the blue. That blue is uh, <laughs> it's fantastic. Now, they did match up the shade of the purple for his armor and his boots pretty close. Uh, minus, obviously, the shine. But, yeah, this is a pretty good figure. I, you know, I wasn't really, uh, wasn't really excited to pick this guy up. Uh, in the beginning, I was trying to be a completionist and get all the different waves. Uh, but like so many of you... It's just been a nightmare to try to get all these figures. So, but I, I luckily I was able to pick him up. And I'm glad that I did because I think I'm going to prefer this guy in my display versus uh, our vintage. Uh, he's not in the best of shape. But, you know, overall he's pretty decent for, for what it is. So, yeah, what do you guys think? You like the new web store? Uh, did you wish maybe we could have got like a deluxe version of him where we had a different head and... Maybe the the additional arms. I don't know. It's, it's it, I think it might have might have sold better. It might have been a better figure if if they would have done that. But anyway, sign off in the comments. Let me know your thoughts. As always, appreciate you guys sticking around, and uh, I'll be back with another one soon. Thanks.